hi this is Miss D from D Special Things I am actually just crafting how about you guys this weekend um, yesterday it just turned cold out of nowhere so I've been in my craft room trying to do some crafts and a little reorg I've been reorganizing all year huh but I did want to come and show you a project that I did using a top hat. I made the top hat because I did not want to pay as much as um, Amazon wanted for their top hats. So yeah, this was inspired by the actual project itself using the top hat was inspired by um, uh, what's her name? Uh, what? Angela's um, Oh, I don't know. Um, Angela's designs. Angela Holt's designs. Okay. So, yeah. I actually, just because she used the top, top hat, I liked it. I wanted it. And it's a few other projects that I've seen on YouTube that I like to do. Um, not copying anyone's project, but actually using what they used and creating my own. But this is my first top hat. I made four of them all together and I showed you how I made it in one of my videos prior to this is um, on one of my what's on your workstation um, videos but yeah I use ribbons laces um, sequence bows um, yeah you name it I pretty much used it and I wanted I started off making this a color like my intention was to use these colors and I have to tell you where I got this idea from too this is another project that I saw on YouTube and yeah I did that I've been doing projects you guys but yeah this is the actual top hat that I made and I was thinking about putting a little bench here and I have two little deer. I'm not certain that I'm going to put those there though. But this is more so a centerpiece. I even have a light to put on it. But I'm not certain about the light right now. Well, I have two different lights so I'll see how they turn out. I think if I use the light, I'll probably put the light around. Not around it, but near it so that... The reflection bounces off of the hat because I have loads of, let's see, the dry stickles, the ranger stickles all over this hat. I'm not certain that it's, it will pick it up, but yeah, on the top of it, on the side of it, and down on the base of it. But yes, this is a project that I made. I was trying to think of something to do for my sisters but I don't know that this is a project I can't finish it by Thanksgiving so this may not be the project because I have to do quite a few of them but I love this I did so much um, cutting little pieces and of lace and the doilies and just adhering it to this um, ribbon and cutting them apart and yes I was quite happy with this when I finished I'm not certain that everyone doesn't like my style and I understand that but um, I thought this was really pretty um, I thought it was done tastefully um, yeah and I used a lot of elements so if you're looking to do something that It'll take time. Um, I don't think I do. I don't think I get much joy out of doing a lot of projects that's simple and easy. I think the projects that I enjoy doing take some time to do them and you have to put forth some, you know, you just have to put forth time. So I'm sure a lot of people are not going to do um, what I do because it does take, it, it takes time to do it. So, but I enjoy doing this, this, um, 
my sequins are coming off but yeah everything that I put on here as far as the sequin um, the little roses the little yeah beads I actually put on the Christmas tree and I had to do those one by one using a little tweezer thing but yeah this is my project right here I am absolutely loving this and um, yeah tell me what you think this is the first one I'm thinking about doing something like this again but I'm finding out I didn't want to do the paper mache all over again it takes a few days for that to dry and but because of the hats and the, the way I put them together I'm gonna have to paper mache it to get a smooth a uh, smooth um, yeah I'm gonna have to do it because I tried not doing it with this one and I call myself painting it but you have to paper mache it in order for it to get that smooth finish so yeah and it actually looks like a cake when you finish yeah but I was really happy with this uh, next I'm going to do some different shapes and I'm going to try them with colors but I was really happy with this one so um, I'm going to sit it as a centerpiece right now I was even going to put a ballerina slipper on it but I don't know that I'm going with that I think I'm going to leave this exactly like it is right here and that is my top hat I like this Yes, I'm going to do more. All right, everyone, thanks for watching. I have other projects going on. I have lots of other projects going on. I'm going to try and do as many as I can um, before I <clears throat> before the holidays. Yeah, because um, after today, I'm going to clean up. It, I won't be doing any more projects until after the holidays. So, yeah. But anyway... That is my project. I'm liking it. I'm loving this. I'm going to put celebrate right here and I have to cut the letters out. I'm using foil stickers. That's what I'm using. Stickers. But I'm going to foil them um, with silver. Yes. Yeah, so I'm having to wait to do that. and Because uh, I have a mess in my room right now. But yeah. Thanks for watching. And I will... Talk to you later. If I do anything else to this, I will do another, show you another picture of it. But tell me what you think. Is that okay? Does it look like a top hat? I think it does. Really, when I first did it, I said, oh, that looks more like a cake. Yeah, but that, that was before I even laced it. Yeah. But, yes, that's it right there. Alright, you guys. Tell me what you think. Thanks for watching. Talk to you later. Hope you all have a, are having a nice weekend. All right, bye-bye.